Okay, so I'm really sad right now because I just got out of Target and I ran out of memory because I was about to tell you guys something and I accidentally just deleted the first clip of this video. So, the first clip of this video is now here. So, hi, welcome to the vlog. Um, you're gonna be thrown into my morning right now. I am a little orangey because I tanned. Um, but yeah, we're gonna um, throw you into today's vlog right now. What are you doing? Are you How'd you sleep? It does. Apparently my kids think it's lunchtime, so they're having lunch food instead of breakfast for some reason, but that's okay. As long as they're eating, I'm not mad. Oh, what are you I don't know why they saw me. Okay, so while the kids are eating, I need to put you up higher because you're way too low. There we go. Okay, so while the kids are eating, I'm looking a hot mess, but I um, got this massager in the mail and it is a mini massage gun. If you guys haven't heard of these, like you need to get one, especially if you work out and especially if you're new to working out, even if you're not new, I feel like you need one of these. Um, so my husband and I have been loving this. This one is from Bob and Brad. It comes in a super nice case and they were so kind to send this to me and I've been obsessed with it. I do it probably every morning. Um, so we used to have one before and it was really horrible quality. This one, it's such nice quality. Like it's really nice. And um, my husband and I have been getting into working out a lot. We've been doing really well with it and we're proud of ourselves. And, but the thing is, um, you become very sore, especially like me. I don't work out every day. So, and when I do work out, I work out really hard. So my inner thighs are always hurting my back, my arms. So what this does is like it vibrates really hard. You can like change the settings on it, but you can, it vibrates and then it, um, releases the lactic acid in your muscles so it helps you heal faster so this one is nice because it comes with the case and it comes with like all the attachments that you would need different ones for different stuff and i'll show you some of them there's this one and we have this one this one is just really get into those kinks and then this one but the one we use the most is the ball. And that's what it looks like. And then it has these settings on it. You just hold it for a couple seconds. And then, and you can turn, turn it up higher. And it's so small, like my husband can take this to the gym. And so, oh my gosh. So it hurts like a little bit, like especially when you're sore. But then after you're done doing it, it's like a, uh, but then after you're done doing it, it's like, so it feels so much better, like so much more relief, Ugh, especially when you do a really intense like leg workout. I feel like the legs are like the worst. So anyway, my husband and I have been loving this and I wanted to share it with you guys because they were so kind to send it to me and we are obsessed with it. The dog is obsessed with it too. She loves it. So every time she hears it turn on, she comes over and thinks she's going to get like a little back massage. Highly recommend. Um, I'll have a link to this one down below, but there's so many speeds on it, as you can see. Turns up, 
and you can change all the different little settings and stuff and it comes with a charger and it's portable it's so small and nice and it's really good quality so if you like are new to working out or you're not new to working out and you're a pro at working out i feel like you need one of these because i didn't even know i needed one of these until i had one and my husband and i do this every morning almost every evening just because it helps our muscle repair so much so anyway highly recommend i'll have the link code possibly all the stuff down below and you can check it out for yourself oh yeah oh that is beautiful it's like sunset shimmer okay let's I do like let's do duh. Duh. make the oh. sound duh. Punch, 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 punch. No. Baseball. That's a book. You know no, that? Yes. Oh. What? Okay. Oh, well, mad faces. Okay. No, it's okay. What sound is this? Okay, so I just finished doing some homeschool with Victoria and, um, everything like that it took us like about two hours or about an hour and a half two hours um they're watching a show so i'm gonna do a quick workout just throw on a sports bra i don't like to always change into like really cute workout equipment i mean clothes i normally just throw on whatever and at least a sports bra so i'm not like flopping around and stuff but i'm just gonna do a quick 10 minute workout because it's beautiful outside today i want to let the kids play outside and then i have some errands to run so i'm just gonna try and do a really really quick like 10 minute um, hit workout. So that is what I'm going to show you guys real quick. clothes on i don't know who i think i am today but i got jeans on i don't think i've worn jeans in a while but we're gonna go play outside and then we're gonna go to target right okay so i just got out of target and um i got myself one of these watermelon what is it with a u a h a a honey honey i don't know how to pronounce it blueberry and pomegranate and i'm gonna try it my friends tell me this is so good it has zero calories zero sugar it's like seltzer water or sparkling water but with like obviously no alcohol in it um but supposedly it's really good so i'm gonna try it <sighs> hold on one minute I'm gonna give you a little Target haul because I haven't done one in a really, I feel like a long time. I know I always do Target hauls, but then again, I feel like I haven't done one in a couple vlogs now. So let's go back, circle back to this drink. I thought it was a Alani drink. My friends always talk about, it's not, it's not what it is. Um, but if you do like soda and you're trying to kick the habit, this would be good. It's like a sparkling water. I don't particularly love it though, just because I rather have a White Claw and have alcohol in it if I'm gonna drink something like this. I don't really drink soda, so it doesn't matter to me. Um, but I thought this was like those Alani new, the energy drinks, but it's not. So, there's that. And then I got some crispy light granola. I don't know, it looked like healthy. I know this brand is healthy, but also it looked like a good like breakfast alternative for me. And then what I went there for, which were some paper towels. Some orange juice, some fabric softener. I've used that brand before, but I use a different scent. So this is a new scent for me. And my friends were telling me to get the Dreft like fabric softener, or I'm sorry, detergent, but I'm not out of detergent yet. So I didn't want to waste like getting detergent. So I got these, I've never used these scent blasts before, but we're gonna try them out on like the towels and the linens and stuff like that but it's supposed to smell like a long lasting scent of baby so they said it's really good so i'm gonna try it oh yes i got a candle 
It smells so good. Ah, oh, it smells so good. What is the scent? It's called Moonlit Hibiscus, and it smells like coconut. It's a soy candle, and it's really good. I was out. My candle over here is out, so I needed a new one. And then an eyelash curler. I've been needing one, so I picked one up. Toilet paper, because we were running out, and that's why I went there. Water, which you saw me carry in. And then... I got some, my friend Carly has these jeans and she said they're so comfy and amazing and they're like the boy, or they're the mom jeans. And so they had them in my store and I can't wait to wear them. They're the Wild Fable brand and they were really cheap. So they have really cute big rips in them and then hers got like really ripped and they look good though. So I'm excited to rock these. I needed a new pair of jeans, you know, cause I wore jeans today, the first time in 20 years. So I had to buy another pair for like, in 20 years when I decide to wear another pair, right? <laughs> I'm just kidding. And then I got this really cute shirt. It is like a peplum style little shirt. It's like a pink and blue tie-dye. They also had an orange one, which I was contemplating getting, but Tor said that she liked this one better. So we picked out this one. Nice for spring. And then some really exciting wipes. Nothing too exciting except for the candle is pretty exciting and also the clothes, but I can't wait to light this. I also stopped at um, Chick-fil-A and picked up some lunch. It's actually a little later now. I'm making a really yummy dinner recipe, which I'm going to share in today's vlog, but I was starving and so the kids wanted a milkshake, so I just picked up a little something and I'll share with you what I got because it's definitely on the healthier side. Erin Williams um, shared it and I wanted to try it. So I thought it was kind of funny because I ordered the kids like milkshakes and then also a large fry for them to share. And um, the lady was probably like, you ordered this really healthy sandwich and then you're gonna get all this junk, but whatever. Um, so here it is. It is a spicy deluxe with pepper jack cheese and then no bun. You do a lettuce wrap, like a lettuce bun. And then you add bacon and tomato. And then you add ranch as well. So I'm excited. Looks like they forgot my bacon and my, oh no, there's bacon in there. Mm, I'm excited. Oh, it's spicy. I need two. You guys want some of your fries? Or not yet? Oh. Okay. I'm going to try it because I'm excited. My Chick-fil-A sucks, so, you know, it took that. I, they had to pull me around the corner so that way they can make this. It's a little messy, but it's probably going to be good. So, let's see. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-hmm. Mm. I like that. I definitely don't miss the bun. Like, I don't really like the bun that comes on the clubs anyway. So, this is good. You should try it. Next time you go to Chick fil A, try it out. Oh, okay. Don't eat too many. Okay. I just finished eating my food and I was emptying out the bags and I forgot. I got some new nail polish. So, I got this one. It's called AW from this brand, I don't know what it's called. And then I got watermelon from Essie. So I'm probably gonna paint my toes this color, my nails this color. I'm not sure that Tor picked out this color. She's my girl. Um, I was like, what color should I get? And she was like, I like this one, but I like this one. So I got both. Um, I always paint my own fingernails and toes. I have been probably for the past couple months especially since we moved here because i haven't found a place that i want to go get my i know normally just get my toes painted but i've been doing my fingernails and my toenails so whatever it's worth it to me to get some nail polish i always like to pick out new nail polish every time i go to target just because like it makes it more enjoyable like if i already have to do all the work at home at least i'm gonna get some cute new colors so i can make myself feel good about it so anyway I'm gonna clean up this mess and then I'm gonna show you the clothes on because I'm excited. I wanna see what these jeans look like on me. Jeans, I didn't button them all the way. They have a button fly, but um, they're cute. I feel like I would just roll the ends, um, but when these rips rip a little bit more, they'll be so cute. Also, um, they're really comfortable, like like very, very comfortable. And they make your booty look good. So 10 out of 10, recommend. I'll have these um, linked down below if you want to check them out. 
And here's the top with it. How cute. I love it. Top's really cute. I got a um, small in it. And I think if it's really good, it's really comfortable. And it's kind of like a free people dupe. I think they had... Um, Free People has something like this. Sorry about the escaping. <laughs> I promise they fit. I just didn't feel like buttoning all those. Buttoning all those. But I don't think I'm gonna take these off. These jeans are so comfy. I tried written down the words to say it is time. I've been waiting five days to explain how you make me feel inside, baby. Got it all figured out. Wanna do this right? There's no doubt in my mind, baby. You're the one. And tonight I am going all the way. Mmm, but when you touch my hand, it all goes away. The things I planned. running late today coming home so he's actually just gonna pick up some chick-fil-a for himself um i'm gonna make the dinner that we had planned on making but he's up at meps like getting someone squared away with recruiting or joining or something like that i have no idea but he's never home this late which is crazy but it's also really nice because i've been able to clean the house and like do all the things so it's seven o'clock i'm gonna start on um the dinner that i planned on making i'm still full from the chick-fil-a that i ate so i'm just gonna make it though so that way i can have it for lunch tomorrow because i love it as leftovers it's my favorite and i hate leftovers so it's a big deal for me I'm really upset you guys. I had gotten all the ingredients out and realized that I forgot one main ingredient which is tomatoes and we don't have any. I can't even substitute and I need it to make the chili so uh, so I'm sorry. I'll have the recipe that I was going to make linked down below. I also have it in my um in my highlights on Instagram and I show you all the stuff so I definitely will make it in a vlog soon but it won't be in this vlog because your girl forgot something that she needed so anyway we're gonna carry on with the vlog so i'm gonna put this stuff away i'm not even hungry honestly anyway um and my husband like i said is gonna pick up something so i'm just gonna make the kids some dinner and then do like bedtime routine and stuff so i'll share that with you guys before ending the vlog but i'm sorry i really thought i was gonna make this dinner but i'm sad now now i'm gonna have to make it tomorrow and then i don't have any lunch for tomorrow so anyway <sighs> mom brain i feel like this happens to me all the time i either don't dip all the chicken or i'm forgetting an ingredient or something like that please let me know down in the comments that i'm not the only one because i feel like this happens to me way too often <laughs>
Will you have a good day? Mm -hmm. Love you to describe that bedtime. Uh, <laughs> interesting. I'm literally speechless. We exercised before bed. Yeah. They were losing it. Literally losing They're, it. They're uh, psychopaths. <laughs> but anyway, that is it for today's vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. We're gonna watch a movie or the show. What is the show called again? Tell me your secrets. Mm -hmm. Tell me your secrets on Amazon TV if you, or Amazon video if you haven't watched it yet. My hair is just all kinds of crazy. Um, but I will see you guys in my next one. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye guys. <laughs>